Can I get you anything? Oh, uh, yeah. It's actually fun. Oh, Ryan, come on. You haven't even said a proper hello to your sister yet. Mum, we're not 12. Sorry about my father. Yeah, OK. Or are you just saying that because she made you? Look, it, it, it's nothing personal, but I've got, I've got to go. Yeah, OK. Well, better place to be better people with you, right? I'm really sorry that your life has been turned upside down during the club. But you know, you being my brother is it's just not something I can deal with right now. Brother? Him? Nowhere. Um, let's go inside, shall we? Yeah, so she can tell you her shameful secret. How is he your brother? Is he yours? She tell him. Am I really that bad? No, God, no! Mum, you're freaking me out. OK, I'm sorry. This is Ryan. He's your brother. This is not how I wanted it to come out to any of you. But well, we never hear, right? No, I didn't mean that. I... No, please wait. Let... Just let me explain. I'm really sorry. Look, he's your son. He needs you. Go. And you won't leave. Go. I do not let him leave, babe. Look, my sitter's cried off sick. I have to go pick Johnny up. Can you keep an eye on this one here? I'm not off you. You are not shifting. I'll call the cop. No, you won't. OK, then. I'll call the taxi. No, well, look, don't. Why not? Oh, uh, well, I guess it'll give me a chance to get to know who it is that's giving me all this grief. Go on, you go ahead. I'll meet you at the hospital. Well, what should I tell Sarah? Uh, tell her that Gwen and Charity needs sorting. Again. Why do you care if I take off? Because Mum's terrified that you won't come back. Look, I don't want to keep you from Sarah. I take it she told you about her. Do you want to tell me some more? No, we're just waiting for someone. The right someone. To die. Before she does. I mean, she will be fine. You know, I'll make sure of that. Charity didn't do a bad job with you. You have no idea. Can't be that bad. Well, I wouldn't even know where to start. Yeah, well, at least she didn't need you for dead. She was a kid herself. You know, barely, barely older than what Sarah is. I don't blame her, really. Don't. You know, I was, I was about the same age when I found her and my dad. Well, it's not like having the same kind of eyes, but I mean, there's something in common. She can't be that bad. I mean, if you're here holding me hostage. Hey, I am not. <laughs> yeah, you are, but you're doing it for her. She has a moment. Well, I'm not just sticking around for her anyway, cos, you know, you might be worth getting to know. You love me. Yeah, oh, shut up. Come on, let's go inside and see if Noah's calmed down enough to meet you yet. Listen, Mum is selfish. And frustrating. Reckless, impulsive and damn right dangerous at times. But I wouldn't lose her for anything. Cos... Well, cos she's Mum. And, you know, she tries to get it right. And I think even when she does get it wrong, you know, we need to think about what she's been through. I mean, it's amazing that she gets any of it right, really. Come on. Let's go inside and work this through together. <laughs> 